This is Dr. Melissa Chotel, and today we're going to take a look at two models that I've printed on my SprintRay Pro 3D printer. This is a patient case that I am treating with clear aligner therapy, and this patient is currently at step number 15 in their aligner progress. ULab has had a big update to the software, allowing us to now print either horizontally or vertically in print orientation on the 3D build platform. The model that I printed on the left is in the horizontal orientation as I had printed all of his previous models. And the model on the right was printed in the new vertical orientation to help me maximize the area on the build platform. In order to check and verify that there were no changes when I re-exported the patient's models, I fabricated an Essex style retainer out of a very thick and durable material. I formed the vacuum form on the horizontally printed model and trimmed. And then to verify that I would have the same fit on my new vertical printed models, I then tried the retainer onto the new vertical print. I was able to achieve an excellent fit and adaptation in the new print orientation, allowing me to double check that there had not been any changes in the integrity of the prints making sure that I could transition from horizontal printing to vertical printing in my patients currently in treatment using my ULab software. This is going to be very helpful as I can now print more models in the vertical orientation on my SprintRay Pro 3D printer. This is going to really cut down the laboratory time that I have and that I'm using in 3D printing for my clear aligner treatment.